Alrighty gang, welcome back to Adventures AK. Back at it uh, here at my buddy's, right here. He's back there, he saw him, the big leg boy. Kylie's here. We're here shooting some carp, all right? Uh, this is one of the same fields that I was uh, bow fishing in about a week or two ago. Uh, I shot like 30 carp, 20 carp, somewhere in there. And uh, the lake, the pond went down that was flooded, but they're still out and about. We just gotta find these areas that are still up a little bit because they're out in the main lake, main water, and it's too deep. So we're gonna see if we can get in some shallow stuff and put a beat down on these carp. We got three of us here, so hopefully we get some cool shots. So let's do it. Really? They were in here. Look at the mud kicked up on your right. Oh shit, what's in front of you there? This looks good. If I were a carp, I'd yep, be... it's right here, right over here. Yeah, yeah, right here. There's one right up here. Right there. I'm shooting him. He's mine. Dibs. Shit. You guys, that's a long shot. All right. That's a long shot for these. There's fish one, a little, probably three pounder, nothing crazy. He was, he was sitting so shallow. Get off. What the fuck? What am I stuck on? That son of a bitch got off. I hit him right in the head. He's right there, guys. Right there. He's right there. Good shot. Good job. Good eye. Whoo. <laughs> Good job. Oh. Son of a 
bitch. We'll take him right over here. All right, that's a wrap on that video. Uh, got out of there quick. We didn't have time to shoot an outro. It's like a couple days later, right here on the porch, drinking some claws, breaking some laws, grilling. So I uh, finally got some nice weather, so got to take advantage of that. Um, I only killed five, five carp on the day. I hit two more, so really seven uh, ended up getting shot, but those two got off. I don't know, one of them was a direct headshot. Hit him right in the dome and he still shook it somehow, so. That was pretty crazy, but uh, Kylie shot one. Parker shot one too, we didn't get it on camera. We kind of split up uh, once we, we crossed it, uh, like a channel on one of his canoes and we ended up on an island that was flooded. So half of it was underwater, half of it was out and we just kind of waded through the grass as you saw and ended up not doing too bad. That water's real dirty. It's hard to shoot those carp in there because one, the water's filthy. It's like chocolate milk. Two, it's deeper than what you think. I mean, you're up in the reeds, but it's still up to your knees. And that's tough to see them. I mean, even if you have polarized sunglasses, it doesn't do you any good if that water's that dirty. Uh, number three, the carp are tiny in there. The biggest one you see is like five pounds. So when you're used to shooting them 10, 12 pound carp and you downgrade seven or eight pounds, that, that's a tough shot to make, especially in dirty water. So it was fun anyways. It's always fun to go there and take out some carp. I'm sure we'll be back there again sometime this summer. So uh, yeah, these guys, where are they at? Angler Performance Fishing, everything's down below. Check that out. Promo code KILLER10 gets 10% off whatever you like. Uh, find me on Facebook, Instagram, at Adventures with a K, and we will see you on the next adventure.